Hi, this is Daniel DeTuro. Do you look for specific types of fats or oils for cooking and baking? In this video, I'll share the three types of fats, the properties of fats and oils, and percentages of the three fats for 19 fats and oils used for home cooking and baking. Most people know there are three types of fats, saturated, monounsaturated, and polyunsaturated. Polyunsaturated fats also go by the acronym PUFA. All oils and fats are a combination of these three types of fats, and they're classified by their predominant fat, like monounsaturated in the case of olive oil. You math geniuses have noticed that the numbers do not add to 100%. So what's the other 2%? Depending on the fat, they can include water, vitamins like E and K, and impurities. Unrefined fats like extra virgin olive oil have more impurities than refined fats. Impurities are harmless, but they can reduce a fat's smoke point. Smoke point is important if you do a lot of high temperature cooking. When it comes to the three types of fats, Vegetable oils and fats usually have less saturated fat than animal-based fats and oils. One exception is coconut oil with 86% saturated fat. Fats high in saturated fat tend to be solid at room temperature. All plant fats and oils have zero cholesterol including coconut oil. Fats and oils have between 100 to 130 calories per 12 to 15 gram serving. For example, butter at 85% fat has about 100 calories per 14 gram serving. Olive oil at 98% fat has about 130 calories per 15 gram serving. The next section lists the three types of fats for 19 common fats and oils in alphabetical order. We begin with almond oil. It's 70% monounsaturated and has zero cholesterol. Avocado oil is also about 70% monounsaturated and slightly higher in saturated fat than almond oil. Beef tallow is a saturated fat with 10 milligrams of cholesterol per 15 milliliter serving. Butter has about the same percentage of saturated fat as beef tallow, but three times the cholesterol. Canola oil is about 88% mono and polyunsaturated fat. As I've mentioned, coconut oil has about 86% saturated fat. Corn oil is our first polyunsaturated fat at 55%. Duck fat is a saturated fat, but also has 42% monounsaturated fat, making it partially solid at room temperature. Flaxseed oil is a polyunsaturated fat at 68%. Lard is a monounsaturated fat that's solid at room temperature. Soft margarines are about 63% mono and polyunsaturated fats. Hard margarine is slightly higher in saturated fat compared to soft margarines. The predominant fat is still monounsaturated. Olive oil is one of the leading monounsaturated oils. Peanut oil is almost 80% poly and monounsaturated. Safflower oil has one of the highest percentages of polyunsaturated fat. Sesame oil is borderline poly and monounsaturated. Shortening is a monounsaturated fat with slightly higher saturated fat than hard margarines. Sunflower oil is high in poly and monounsaturated fats and low in saturated fat. Our last oil is soybean that has about 66% polyunsaturated fat. Please leave a comment if you have any questions about this video. Thank you for watching and healthy eating!